Hey everybody. Hope everybody's doing well today. I'm over here at the park again. I've got no new updates. Nothing. Um, I do know my mother-in-law and father-in-law are just chomping at the bit to get up and out of here. My father-in-law is 82 years old and he says it's time for me to go home. And I believe him. He needs to retire and take it easy. Uh, I have a feeling that when this happens, it's going to be pretty quick. And uh, we're just going to get up and get on out of here pretty fast. So, at least I hope so, because we're just about at 1st of July. No tickets yet. So I told my wife, let's get these tickets. You don't buy the tickets for right now. You buy them for later. And if you wait till later to get the tickets for later, you're going to pay a premium for those tickets. So we could we could get on out of here right now. We've got all the paperwork. We've got everything. Uh, if she comes with us. And I, I've heard that they are possibly lowering the quarantine to seven days. For vaccinated uh, people coming in uh, that would include my wife and my mother-in-law and father-in-law now me I have not gotten the shot and my kids are too young so they're not gonna get it of course so uh, that would mean that they get to uh, do a seven-day quarantine and we still have to do the 10-day uh, in-hotel and the 4-day in-home quarantine. Which is fine with me. I'm not complaining. You know, give me the swab test, whatever it takes. Uh, but as of right now, I'm standing firm on not getting this shot. I'm just holding off. Uh, I am older. A little bit overweight. <laughs> uh, but... Uh, I'm in good health, so uh, I got aches and pains, of course, but uh, yeah, I'm not going to get it right now. I'll hold off. So uh, anyways, and my kids are just too young. They're too young to get it right now, even my daughter, so they won't be getting it. Anyways, uh, I'll keep you informed. Like I said, I think this might be something that happens pretty quick. Because my mother-in-law and father-in-law, they really want to get out of here. They want to go back home. And I don't blame them. At 82, yeah, I think I'd want to go home. I'd say, you know what? It's time for me to go home right now. And I'm not waiting. So we've got all our passports. We've got everything. We've got all our, I've got all our documents. And we're ready to go. So... My wife doesn't have to spend 14 days in quarantine, hopefully. So that will allow her to go. She can only do seven days in the quarantine and go home. I'll still be in the hotel, which is fine with me. I know my way home. <laughs> there was one time that my wife said that, uh, you know, she grew up in Cebu. She, I'd made so many trips to uh, Cebu City that she said I knew I knew the area better than she did because <laughs> I took so many trips. Anyways, uh, I'm going to get off this thing and post it, finish my laps up, and uh, hopefully I'll have some good news for you pretty soon. And we'll have the tickets and we'll be able to uh, make our uh, way back to Cebu. Okay, I'll catch you later. Thanks for watching.